Hello, my name is Leopold Armesto and in this presentation I will introduce you gas sensors with Facilino. So this is the outline of the presentation. First I will introduce the material that we will use for this presentation as well as the work instructions and then uh, I will move on to the sensor calibration and uh, the heat up process that the, this gas sensor needs. And then at the end of this presentation I will introduce two exercises. The first one is for calibrating uh, the gas sensor and the second one is to show you how to measure uh, alcohol with these sensors. So this is the material that we will use for this presentation. In particular we're using as usual the Wemos D1R32 together with the Arduino multi sensor shield and also we will use in this presentation the MQ2 gas sensor. Okay, so these are the work instructions. First instruction here it's used to calibrate uh, the internal resistor to get a measurement of the internal resistor R0 and this instruction will allow us to, uh, once we provide here with the analog pin where the analog sensor is connected, the, uh, it will provide us the value for this resistor that we can print on the console and we just simply uh, can annotate and use it afterwards for this instruction which will provide calibrated measurements in particles per million of a specific gas that we can select. So we can select uh, the type of sensor and we can select the type of gas here. Depending on the type of sensor, the type of gas is detected will vary. And then in the end here we will obviously have the concentration uh, for this particular gas. So how this sensor works? This sensor provides an analog measurement that it's uh, proportional to the value of an internal resistor RS and uh, a resistor R0. So this ratio here it's uh, something we measure and we can see here from the datasheet from the manufacturer that at clean air, so this is this curve here, this uh, value here is approximately uh, this value here. So the idea is that when we try to calibrate this sensor we have to measure or we have to know this, this uh, this ratio here and in the end we have to measure uh, uh, the, the value and at, at clean air and we can estimate or provide a value for the uh, resistor R0 that we will use later to provide the gas concentration. And this complex formula here, don't worry about that because it's obviously implemented in Facilino but the idea is that as you can see here this is a log scale algorithm for the concentration and this is a log scale algorithm for the measured value. So as you can see here in this log scale, uh, this more or less behaves linear, so that's why we have this 10 to the power and the log things here. But in this log scale here, this behaves more or less linear. So in the end, what we will be able to do is to measure this value here and depending on the type of gas we're measuring, then we will get the appropriate concentration. So this sensor uh, in order to work properly needs a heat up and here I'm just simply plotting uh, the analog value that I was measuring with the sensor and as you can see here it takes approximately 30 minutes to heat up so at the beginning the, the value could be slightly higher and once it's, it's warm then it gets stable. So this should be the, uh, the, corres the corresponding procedure that we need to calibrate. So after 30 minutes then we can calibrate and measure the, uh, and, uh, the, the internal resistor R0 and in this case after the calibration for instance I could get for the MQ2 sensor I could get that the internal resistor was 1.76 kilo ohms. Okay? So, now let's move to the example. So this is the, the code I use for the calibration. So at the beginning what I'm doing is I'm just simply uh, waiting for pushing the button uh, connected to pin D2 and what I'm doing is I'm just simply uh, printing the analog value. So with that uh, you can, you can uh, get uh, the, the previous uh, picture I show you. Okay, so after some time then what I did is, okay, I push the button and then I start the calibration process here. And then here after a while, not very long, I will get a value for the R0 and then I print this value and then I can annotate that value so I can use it in later uh, use. For instance, in this case, 
Okay, so now that I know that for this sensor or my specific sensor I have this value here, then what I can do is to read the concentration and then select okay, this, the sensor and with the sensor we can measure with the same resistor here, we can measure different uh, type of gases. In this example we are measuring the alcohol concentration. Okay, so in this presentation I have introduced you how to use gas sensors with Facilino. Thank you very much.